Hello guys, how are you? So as promised in this channel here, there's an easy way to deal with your case. We'll make a video about it later. So I was pointing to or referring to this case. Where, where is that case? Yes, this case. So I will put a direct link on the description of the video uh, to this post so that you can check it if you want. So there's other posts that comes so here the guys are trying to explain to the requester the difference between kilobyte and uh, megabit and uh, megabyte etc so useful information is here in fact for uh, uh, beginners and for those who are not experienced with the uh, deal files and the uh, sizes of the files so we came to this one here we in which he shared the uh, three files so these files are this one is a bios image it has 8 megabyte size and this one is the a the ac file it's uh, uh, version a11 uh, probably uh, extracted from an executable file if I haven't understood exactly what the guy has said later on because I have asked him and this one is his uh, uh, backup of the AC uh, BIOS file but the problem with this one, which he is trying to use with uh, his ship, is that it has a bigger size if we compare it to the backup. The backup has only 128 kilobyte, and this one is a 1 megabyte file. So, as I said, there's a, an easy way to deal with this case, in fact, without losing much time with it we uh, let me close this we go uh, directly to the browser and we tape this model m17 xr4 so m17 xr4 bios hit enter the first result you click on it you will get something like this and you will get the last update which is A15 and we have A11 here in this case so to make things clear and in order that everybody can understand what uh, go what we are going to do in this video it's better to look for the same version a11 so to look for another version of this of this model here we go here let me check where here yes well we have uh, Alienware M17 XR4 here we click on it uh, let's uh, translate this to English so that everybody can understand so we go to compatible systems and we click on Alienware M17 XR4 close this and we got this page we go to BIOS let's again translate this to English so we put here as a keyword BIOS and we get this again the last update like in here so here 10 December 2018 same date here we just expand here and we go to earlier versions and we have here 
a11 we download it so here we have a11 and here we have the download button let's click on it let's create a folder in this folder where is so we go to this there is temporary folder here in my desktop we create a new folder with the name of the guy yes open and save let's open the folder check if we can extract with winrar yes so extracted let's check what do we have here yes here we have the bin file yes which has 9 mega byte which means that it contains both files views image and ac file let's delete the dot exe file we don't need it anymore open here and cut this from here and move it to the main folder here and remove this one we don't need it so let's open this one so as i have said this file should contain both files the bios image and the ac file uh, the easy way to find those blocks is to use the i flash keyword which i use a lot in like the, this case if we got the i s flash win file like this one we use simply i flash yes i have it in the options because i use it a lot so hit ok and there we have the first result and here doesn't look like a bios header so we move to the second result by pressing f3 on our keyboard and here bingo we have this expression bios img so which means that our bios image starts from here so we just we do right click here right click we select a block and if you are familiar with bios images bios files you should know that uh, we need uh, an 8 megabyte file yes we have our 8 and the the is 120 28 kilobytes so we need uh, here we need an 8 megabyte as the bios image which is in hex 800,000 800,000 8 with sorry I made a mistake we should have only 5 zeros 800,000 yes ok so here is the end of our Bios image and and you can know it by this expression here. I don't want to select it because I will lose this selection. Uh, okay, let's copy it first and create a new file and Control V, uh, say, paste it here and go back to our original file. So as I say there, you can see the this expression which means that here is the end here is the end of the views image the views image stops here so here we have i flash i in i in i in i in i amg so this expression means the end of the views image so let's go back to the file just created and save it as views image simply dot bin of course enter 
so we have it where 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 I, oh, I, I, I yes it's in the same folder yes it's saved cancel so now we got the BIOS image now we need the OC the, the AC file again hit F3 to go to the next result and here a nice expression that says a lot so we have find the beginning of the OC file it's from here it shouldn't include this from here so it should start right here so with the right click we select our block which should be uh, for 128 kilobyte file it's always 20 hundred uh, twenty thousand sorry hex length okay so exactly where it should stops it should stop at these zeros so we have the AC which we have to paste in a new file and save it as AC file dot bin save let's close this and let's open our folder and check sizes so we have the views image the right size which uh, standard 8 megabyte file views file should have the right size of the AC file and we are done with this case and now we can compare our files with these files especially this one and this one this one needs to be resized yes but let's download them first in the same folder but we have to uh, create another folder let's call it to compare we have to put the files there which we are going to compare with the others so save the second one and show in folder let's open this one which is bigger it's bigger in fact we just do what we have done with the previous file we select our block here of our block our block here of 20,000 hex length okay like before and we click here we go down and pressing the shift key you click here to select all the zeros and with the back backup Okay, you delete all the zeros and you just save here file save we don't need to uh, open a new file uh, in fact uh, this hex editor does that here we have the backup which is the original file which we have downloaded and here is the file after resizing so here you have the backup in case you need to go to your backup you just uh, modify the extension here you remove this dot dot b i k and you will have the previous file as it is without any modification so we don't need it in fact let's delete it 
let's open now this one here and go back here and open the one which we have extracted earlier analyze compare they are identical so okay now let's open the views image this one which we have extracted we are in the main folder and this one we have extracted it earlier let's open it and the one we have in this folder is the one I downloaded from the server from here this one so don't be confused you have to understand what's going on so we are in to compare and we have to open this one to analyze the views images we have already analyzed the AC files they are identical let's check if these are identical yes that's fine and job has been done correctly I think uh, this file can be uh, managed to extract with your UA file tool not sure but let's check so here you just check the sizes here For example, let's hex view no R no and R not empty. Extract as easy X view. No. I have never done it with this tool in these kinds of files in fact so I, I prefer to deal with this file this kind of files uh, by to do the extractions by uh, sample hex editor I hope it's uh, it's clear and uh, everything is explained as it should and if any question as always you can tag me in the server please in the server I can't uh, answer in the uh, comments of the video in the channel so YouTube channel so bye bye and see you soon in another tito